Last week, Hai Tong International Securities Analyst Jeff Pu relayed information to clients suggesting that Apple is gearing up for mass production of a 20.3-inch foldable device by late next year. This device, described as a hybrid MacBook iPad, would be followed by a foldable iPhone in 2026. Earlier reports hinted that Apple was leaning towards a foldable MacBook due to concerns about the fragility of a foldable iPhone screen for pocket-sized use. Recent reports suggest that Apple and Samsung have inked a deal for Samsung to supply displays for Apple's foldable device. It's unclear whether this deal covers the hybrid device, the foldable iPhone, or both. Industry experts predict a significant rise in the adoption of foldable phones after the launch of a foldable iPhone. While TrendForce projects a global foldable smartphone shipment rate of over 5% by 2027, this estimate doesn't account for Apple's entry into the foldable market. Pooh's report revealed that Apple is experimenting with two internal screen sizes for the foldable iPhone, 7.9 inches and 8.3 inches, slightly larger than the Galaxy Z Fold 5's 7.6-inch screen. It seems Apple is developing a book-style foldable iPhone that opens and closes around a vertical axis. According to Pooh, Apple has expedited its foldable device development due to increased visibility of foldable components in its supply chain checks. Additionally, the hybrid MacBook iPad foldable is expected to target the ultra-high-end market, implying a hefty price tag. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed the video, remember to give a like to the video and subscribe to the channel. And I see you in the next video. Peace out.